American Highway Products started in 1978. Uh, my father had his own engineering firm, and me and my brother were the first crew. Uh, it was just the three of us. We've always used Lincoln welders. Uh, my dad, being you know, he, he chose Lincoln back in 1979 when we bought our first welder, and uh, we've used them ever since then because they work. <laughs> Manhole risers are a product used to raise the lid to grade when you're paving. It's, it's a high liability product, so you have to have strict uh, guidelines on manufacturing and strength of your riser. Lincoln helped us out by introducing us to what technology is out there. I, I see automation a much better solution to the problem than putting in extra welders, extra stations, and extra employees. I'd rather streamline and uh, increase productivity based on automating it. My plan was to take one man, put it in a booth, and have him do the work of two people, okay? And I, I got benefits even higher than that because now he's doing another operation. Normally it would take two guys, one to weld and one to assemble, but with the automation process, I can assemble as the unit's being welded by the robotic system. You know, at first I thought it was just gonna be more of a quality thing. We're gonna get a higher quality product. We're gonna know that the welds are always perfect. The robot knows where to start and stop the weld consistently in the same spot every time. But as we introduced it, we started seeing that production is better. They're more uniform. And one thing that really sticks out is our guys throughout an eight hour day, they're not as worn out because they're not heads down with a MIG welder welding all day. The automated system has improved my position just because it's cut down on the physical labor. I'm able to produce more product of two manual welders, and I'm able to continue on to the next step and continue our product along assembly. Typically when we're welding, uh, we're having to move the entire time. We have to, it's more dynamic as just a worker, but when you're using the robot, all you have to do is load the product on, clamp everything in, and you hit two buttons, and the robot does all the heavy lifting for you. Uh, that welding fixture does 750,000 different size risers. And if you count the skirt, there's a little switch that we have for 10 gauge and 12 gauge. You really have to double that. Setup is a lot to do with our welding process, setting the part up. There's so many different sizes that we manufacture. I don't have to manually adjust every clamp since they all adjust simultaneously. I don't even have to measure the diameter because I can just fit it on and lock it in and it's good to go. It's increased our productivity. Uh, it's double of what a man can do consistently every day, no matter what happens. In fact, with this new robotic cell, not only can a welder keep the robot going, but he can also take on another task. When I was welding manually, it was only welding 150 units. With this, that's welded and assembled 150 to 250 units by one guy. I'd rather spend a lot of money on my wire and make sure it's a perfect weld, have, you know, and going with a robot, it's perfect every time. Well, it, it's lowered our cost. I have noticed we go through less nozzles with the automation, we go through less uh, tips, and we go through less insulators. Quality is probably the biggest concern that we have to make sure that we can always provide a quality product because we know where these products are going to be in, um, in the roadway. Uh, there was a couple other people that said they could do it. Everybody gave the nod and gave us quotes and priced it out, but I didn't feel comfortable with anybody but Lincoln. If you're going to do something, you, just, you do it right the first time. You know, they had a team of people that could really answer any question that came out of my mouth. They'd have that expert there around the table and say, oh, we can do this, oh, we can do this. I love my business, I love my employees, I love coming down here and working, uh, I love my customers. It keeps me busy. Yeah.